I wanted to find a place that no one had ever filmed before. And where we shot The Green Inferno is farther up the Amazon than any other feature film has shot before. I remember when we shot the scene of the students arriving, and it was incredible because all of the villagers became part of the movie. These dudes are real guys who live in a village without electricity, without running water, without any amenities. They, they're constantly battling back the jungle and the animals that live there and making this place their own. The first day we got there, they were they were all receiving us like, uh, like we were family, like we were part of it and it was a beautiful place. It was great to watch the kids of the village start to get it. Kids pick up on things so quickly, and you could see the first day they were nervous, they didn't know what to do, but by the end they were yelling action, they were yelling cut, we had them doing the slate. We really made sure we took care of them. A lot of these people hadn't worked in years. They were farmers, and the elderly people especially came up to us and said thank you so much for bringing this film to our village. It was a wonderful experience. It was. It felt like more than a movie shoot. It was it was something really special for all of us.